Masters athlete Jeffrey Mack took to the indoor track again at the Rad Collegiate Last Chance Indoor Track and Field Meet in Gainesville, Florida today and did extremely well against some top collegian sprinters. He competed in the 60 meter dash, not only in the prelims, but made it to the finals and then later on competed in the 200 meters as well. In the 60 meters, he ended up having an incredible start. As you can see here, he is right out of the blocks with the guys. Let's take a look and see how well he does in this preliminary heat of the 60 meter dash. And here we go, heat one again of our men's 60 prelims. Cunningham one, Sedaris in two, Brown in three, McBride in four, Mack in five, Atherton in six, Kennedy in seven, Watu in lane eight. So far, I was close on lane one and seven, it looked like. It's Cunningham and Kennedy. And it goes to Kennedy there. Jakari Kennedy goes 6.87 for the heat victory, followed by Isaiah Cunningham at 6.89. And third there, Alexander Brown. Awesome preliminary 60 meter dash by Jeff Mack. Let's see how he does in the final. Prelims. Let's see if he can prove upon that in the finals. Right, here we go. Men's 60 finals. Garrison, Brown, Kennedy, Williams, Williamson, Cunningham, Eddie, and Mack. <laughs> well, bring him back. Our first recall of the day. Let's see what the starters decide. So Kashan Garrison's Supreme Performance is out. Try this again now. Men, 60 dash finals. Alexander Brown in two, Jakari Kennedy in three, Kavar Williams in four, James Williams in five, Isaiah Cunningham in six, Michael Eady in seven, Jeffrey Mack in eight. Men's 60 dash finals. Looks like Jakari Kennedy pulled it away here. Former Jones High School star. Former 3A state runner up. And 
Kennedy there runs a speedy 6.72. And it's Williamson for second, and Kavar Williams ends up third at 6.86. But Jakari Kennedy, the great start and close. What an outstanding time there, 6.72. So 7.27 is an excellent result, not just against incredibly fast collegiates, but remember, Jeff Mack is a master's athlete, age 52. So how did he end up doing in the 200 meters against these collegians? Kyle Buchko in five. Antonio Thomas at six. On eight six, our last heat of the men's 200. The Mac and four, Butch code five, Tom six. Set. And we're underway with our final heat of 200. Outside there, that's Antonio Thomas from Florida Memorial, your heat winner, 23-13. Jeff Matt, 23-41 for second. All right. I would say that Jeff's time of 23.41 is incredible, especially considering that he already has the number one world leading time of 2368. So his 2341 today is the new number one world leading time. Awesome job, Jeff. Thank you for tuning in and watching and please look forward to more to come. And by all means, please share and subscribe.